Hi, I'm Greg Palmer. Hi, I'm Emily. This is my daughter. Uh, we're making this video to talk to you guys, to share our story a little bit. Uh, Emily, she's always been the kind of girl who uh, marched to the beat of her own drum. Uh, she's gay. Yeah. And I don't mean the happy way. Well, she's happy. <laughs> she likes girls. No, never. <laughs> you do. Not in my existence. <laughs> so, she told us that she was gay and um, you know, it was just one of those things. It was like, okay, this is my daughter. She's gay. I didn't want to make a big deal about it. I didn't want to tell her it was wrong. I didn't want to, you know, because it is what it is. She's who she is. And if that's what it, she wants to, if that's what she is, she is. I mean, there's nothing I can do about it to change it. And, you know, I love her anyway. Anyway, word got out and kids started making fun of her. Um, they started giving her a hard time. She got real depressed, uh, real... Uh, secluded keep to herself and you know I didn't really think much of it because you know she's a girl and you know when she told me she was gay I was just kind of let it go by and thought, well you know okay um, and so I reached out for some help I had a friend still have a friend uh, David Hokey um, went to high school with him and I, I know that he's openly gay and so I hadn't talked to him in 20 years I, uh, I messaged him and, and asked him, you know, hey, this might sound a little weird, a little crazy, and but I don't know what else to do. You know, my daughter is openly gay. She's having a real hard time. People are making fun of her. People are, are being mean to her. And, you know, she's tried to commit suicide because of this. Do you have any advice? So yeah. he's actually a, a member of the Washington, D.C. Men's Gay Chorus. And he said that they were having a show in, in May and he said that it would be good to bring Emily uh, so that she could see that, hey, it gets better. Um, it's, it's hard right now, but you know, your life can be great. There's so much, pe so much support out there. So many people that are willing to help you. We and went in so and the, the men's chorus and the kids' chorus, they were, they were rehearsing, getting ready for the show. It was the last show of the, the weekend. And uh, we, we took a seat and just was listening and watching. And, and then all of a sudden, you know, people started coming up to us, the, the director, the executive director, uh, Maya Sykes. I mean, all kinds of people just came up to us and said, hey, are you the people from North Dakota? And, and we're like, yeah, we're, we're the people from North Dakota. And so anyways, uh, it was a pretty neat experience. Uh, got a lot of hugs. Uh, a, a lot of uh, the kids, uh, they all came and gave Emily big hugs and embraced her and, and showed such an outpouring of love and and it, it, there was tears everywhere and, and I was just so happy because these strangers that, that I didn't know were, were showing my daughter love like like nobody has ever shown her um, you know as, as far as friends go or, or even strangers you know have never shown her love like that okay. and, and uh, you know told us that it was an amazing thing that, that I brought her out here and, and, and I was like I don't think I did anything amazing I just thought I, I did what a parent would do and, and just take their children to help them any way that we could uh, even though I, I was kind of apprehensive I didn't know what to expect and um, you know we're being told that you know hey you're doing a great thing and I'm I don't know that it's a great thing so you know we went through the show we watched the show and, and it was it was pretty awesome yeah, it's really cool. Yeah, and I got to see Emily come out of a shell that she's been inside of for so long. It was like I had my old Emily back. She was talking to people. She was laughing and, and people she didn't know. I mean, at this, but I guess the purpose of this video is to let you know if you're struggling with, with who you are, it doesn't matter. Just as long as you know who you are, be true to yourself. If you have a, if you have a child and, and they're, they're gay and they come to you, don't discourage them. Don't tell them it's not normal. Because that's the worst thing we can do is discourage our kids in any way, shape, or form. We don't want to do that. We just need to embrace them and, and, and be happy that they have the courage to tell us. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and I am so happy that that Emily had the courage to, to tell us, that to come out and be open. Um, and so this whole experience not only has been great for Emily because your eyes were really opened, huh? What, <laughs> what, what did you think? Um, I thought a lot of things I was amazed about how many strangers that I didn't even know were like hey you can get through this it's kind of just a temporary thing this it, you see you're gonna grow up and it's all gonna be okay and I was amazed it was so great 
Yeah, and, and, and I have so much thanks for all those people at the, of the Men's Gay Chorus, all the people of the, the Gen Out Chorus, and everybody involved because they really helped my daughter and, and changed her life. And, and if you're watching this video and, and you have a, a child who who is gay and is struggling and you're having a hard time accepting that or or dealing with it yourself, just know that it, it doesn't matter if they're gay. It doesn't matter if they're straight. Because what it comes down to is they if they're happy with whom they are, that's what matters. If they find the person they love, be it a man or a woman, it doesn't matter. Because love is love. And that's what it comes down to. So that being said, um, we hope you all uh, maybe get a little something out of this. And, and we just want to thank everybody that, that has supported us and given so much love to my daughter. Uh, it's just been such an amazing thing. And, and I think that I, I know I'm a better person for this whole experience. And, and I know that Emily is, is uh, doing so much better for the the love and the outpouring that was that was shown to us mm -hmm. you guys have a good night peace out <laughs> you're such a nerd <laughs> <laughs>